I will say that like Witherspoon, I've just been doing some research on Witherspoon and I'm kind of nervous because pro football focus ranks him the number one cornerback in this class. He's listed as six foot one eighty. Gonzalez Dude. has two two more Gonzalez inches. Like six, and three, 20 isn't he? He's like he's listed as six two to two oh one. And dep- that could change by the time the combine happens. So who knows? Um he may get up to two oh five, maybe. I don't know. Uh, but with a school like Illinois, I'm like, okay, is this just Big Ten football? Like, they're not necessarily challenging you through the air on these offenses. I mean, the teams that the teams that um, Wisconsin gave up less than fewer points. I gotta pull up these notes real quick. Wyoming, Indiana, Chattanooga, Wisconsin, Iowa, and Northwestern. Not not necessarily USC Thunder and Lightning level offenses to say the least. That's that Illinois gave up less points than them. Illinois gave up less than twenty points to these teams. Oh, but they didn't they hold Ohio State and and like Michigan in check for a little bit too. Michigan they kept in check. I don't think that they played Ohio State this season. But they that Michigan game was close. No, it was definitely close. But my point is is that. Is he really getting challenged that often? And when he is getting challenged, challenged, he's doing well, but that's overinflating his numbers a little bit, like right. Penn State fans are saying about Joey Porter Jr. So I I personally would probably go with Gonzalez just because he's seen probably more pro style offenses in the Pac 12. Yeah, he, especially in the Pac 12. Yeah. Or air he, raid anything. Yeah, exactly. And he's he's bigger, he's stronger. Um, and I think that he could really be a difference maker, even just to like learn from a guy like Darius Slay to learn how to press up and do all these things. And now you have Jordan Davis is learning from Fletcher Cox. That's great. And Kobe Dean is learning probably from TJ Edwards, I would hope. And then you have another young stud on the defense learning from another proven veteran in Darius Slay. So, right. like, so I think that's what they should do.